Hello everyone, I'm Brett. I'm sitting here under my lilac tree, and I'm going to help you make a pastel drawing inspired by Mexican artist Diego Rivera. You'll need paper, pencil, chalk pastels, and a tool to blend with. Rivera was best known for his paintings and public murals. He was inspired by working people and indigenous Mexican culture. Indigenous peoples are the first to live in a particular place. Rivera collected artworks from early Mexican cultures, like the Aztec and the Maya. He was proud of his country's past. He studied its ancient history and spent time with contemporary indigenous people of Mexico to learn about their traditions. Rivera's piece, Profile of an Indian Woman with Lilacs, shows an indigenous Mexican woman carrying purple flowers. When Christopher Columbus came to America, he thought he and his crew had landed in India, so he called the indigenous people they met Indians. Flowers have been important in Mexico since ancient times, for ceremonies and festivals, to grow and to sell, and to just have in the home. What do you think this woman will do with her beautiful flowers? Choose someone to draw. Draw them with something that is important to them. Spending time with someone helps pictures of them be more meaningful. I'm going to draw my grandma. She grew up on a farm and loved gardening. She helped me plant marigolds just like these. They were the first thing I ever grew. I really liked it when she grew rhubarb because she also made my favorite pie out of it. I will draw her surrounded by those plants. I will start with a pencil sketch and then use pastel like Rivera did in his piece. You can blend earth tones, or reds, yellows, and browns, with white to make different skin colors. Pastels will let me blend colors with my fingers and with other tools like a cotton swab or a special artist blending tool called a tortolan, or blending stump. Pastels can also be erased. You can layer pastels one color atop the other, like I did with the black. Here is my finished pastel portrait. Who will you make a portrait of? Share your creations with us.